guys. So here's our crawfish cooker. Filling it up with some water. And then we're gonna add our seasonings, our liquids to the water. And I'll keep you filled. So will this whole thing of salt go in there? Three quarters of it. Three quarters of Three that. Quarters. Just like this, Washington. and we're washing them. Hey, Papa. Some people soak them in the salt bath, right? You can. Yes, they do. Yeah. Okay. People think it makes them throw up. You know, purges them. It doesn't oh, really, really do much. Now. Really? What okay. you want to do is get all the uh, mud and all off of them. Uh -huh. These are pretty clean. Yeah. Perfect. So we'll do that and get everything else ready. Liquid foil. Uh huh. Okay. We're gonna just pour some into there. This gives a flavor to the crawfish. Oh yeah, I smell that. Uh huh. Smell that already? Uh huh. That does give a lot of flavor to the crawfish because yeah. they taste uh, just like that. All right. All right. Awesome. That wasn't that much. So we're just cutting up the lemon. Uh, we'll cut about you know. How many pounds of crawfish? We just put lemon. We'll put them. Put the lemon in it whole. Okay. Into the uh, boiler. We'll boil the water. We've got the water boiling right now. Yes, we we'll do. Put some seasoning in the water, mm -hmm. and then some of this. Uh, we'll put some of this seasoning yes. on the crawfish after we pull them out. And then we got mushrooms. We got corn, corn on the cob. We got some potatoes. potatoes. Now, what all do you cut up? Just your lemons, or do you cut That's up? That's all I'm gonna cut up. Yep. <laughs> you, yeah. Yeah. Everything eat, else goes in whole. You, you, yeah. You eat. Well, I'm, I may cut some of the mushrooms. I'm gonna cut the onions. Yeah, of course the onions. Oil. Crawfish are clean. Veggies are sliced. Ended up slicing the mushrooms, the onions, and the lemons. The potatoes we're just going to throw in. And I'm going to slice up some sausage. We're also just going to throw this in whole. Okay? We've got our butter. So after this all boils, we're going to empty it into one of those coolers. And we're going to add our seafood boil seasoning on top of it. But the butter first, all on the veggies, then the seafood uh, boil seasoning. And then what we're going to do is shake it up in there. Okay, so I'll show you that here in a Talk to it. Here we go. Got the water boiling. Got it boiling. Good to put in our veggies. All right, time for veggies. All right. You got a video? Yep. I'm going to put in some vegetables. Oh, we got some more. Got corn. Yep. And potatoes. Mushrooms, fresh mushrooms, and more fresh mushrooms, and we'll close it up. You get it. Got it. Uh -huh. That's it for right now. All right. seasoning mm -hmm. which you don't have to get this type of seasoning this crawfish seasoning there's a good Louisiana brand as well that you can get uh, probably in Louisiana the Louisiana crawfish seasoning. The, yep. the key is to put it on the crawfish mm -hmm. and then in the ice chest with, I, I use a little nickel fried butter we got at Sam's mm -hmm. we'll put this butter on top of them all over the crawfish makes them peel good and gives them a little buttery taste yeah all right 
pour some more in there. Here's some more right here. Catch that one crawfish, baby. That's the key. That baby is ready to be shook up. Ready to be shook up. up. That's it. All right. That's it. That's Woo! It.